you know, there's an interesting story that was doing the rounds uh, late last evening as well. Mm -hmm. And uh, periodically, we need to talk about it as well. Uh, every now and then comes a news. <laughs> I, I tried my little uh, bit of wordplay over there, Pankaj. Yeah. You, you, you can judge me later, not on air. <laughs> Essentially, the periodic table has been removed from the class 10 syllabus uh, and certain other interesting chapters. Pankaj, throw some light on that as well. What are some of those chapters and uh, what's the significance of this removal, essentially? Well, uh, it beats me, Kabir, uh, uh, speaking of which, because uh, of late we have been seeing a reduction uh, in uh, the content as far as uh, class 12th is concerned. Uh, uh, ten, now 10th is also there. So all those uh, students who, who have just entered class 10th, uh, maybe not this year, but next year, uh, the chapter of periodic table uh, uh, would be removed from uh, their science syllabus. Uh, and this NCERT says, and this is only for NCERT, by the way, and not for any other boards. Uh, uh, that those chapters have been removed for uh, to reduce uh, the workload, the uh, content load uh, from the students. But remember, it will come back in class 11th, and that's when uh, you actually need to have a very close uh, uh, understanding of a periodic table, which actually I remember, Kabir, uh, when we started uh, uh, going through it in class 9th, I believe, <laughs> uh, it started with... Well, uh, I was really bad at math, uh, <laughs> science, uh, Pankaj. So, I mean, ap apart from chemistry, uh, not really well, happening. But it, uh, you know, oh, the, the funny part is that chapter hmm. begins uh, with a, a, a quotation by an American author. Uh, and he talks about, or maybe the one who found actually uh, the periodic table. And he says that uh, this is the most important chapter that you are going to study in science because it talks about the building blocks. And yeah. that has been removed and moved on to... I mean, isn't uh, that the foundational right? basis? Your Absolutely. BR for bromine, uh, your hydrogen. I mean, yes, yes, you still yes. have those questions like, what does NA stand for? <laughs> What's, what, what, what does NA stand for? Uh, sodium. <laughs> All right, there you have it. Uh, yes, I mean, um, uh, a periodic table is something uh, that people, uh, the students also found very interesting also. I mean, and, it's, uh, it's, lots it's, of still, it's still a huge part of my growing up. Yes. I mean, it, it's still with me. Absolutely, absolutely. I know my it's hydrogen, bromine, my yes, the NACLs, inert gases, yes, yes, H2SO4s, yes. and all of that <laughs> is all of that is redundant without your knowledge. And of course, See, the, the the mnemonics with which you learned and memorized that you know uh, the rectification that happened well, of yes, the periodic table. That, that's what I'm saying. It stays on so, with you. So many shortcuts, very fancy, funny shortcuts uh, that people come up with. Some uh, make it as a poem. Some uh, someone would find a very ingenious way of actually <laughs> putting it: KC, NA, BA, BA, and all the rest of the things. But, I mean, that's not uh, the only thing. Uh, let me also tell you that uh, a chapter in democracy, political parties and challenges to democracy has also been removed from class 10th uh, uh, syllabus. So, little less load, but uh, how enlightened it would leave the students remains to be seen. Well, absolutely. Uh, we'll have to wait and watch as to how people are going to react, academicians out there, the parents out there. They're going to be, they're going to be uh, you know, hell-bent on coming down on the NCRT because, trust me, every time they remove something, uh, there is furor in uh, the pedagogical circles and people really take this seriously. And something else right. significant and something as important as the periodic table, I mean, I fail to understand why somebody like the NCRT is uh, going to come up with that. And I mean, chapters on democracy, uh, Mughal uh, chapters removed, uh, you know, Alama Iqbal, the person who wrote Sare Jahan Se Achha, Hindu Sita Mera, right. that chapter been dropped from DU. People are saying this is the BJP's uh, way to saffronize textbooks. But away from all of that, I mean, what has the periodic table got to do with any of it? And <laughs> the load on the students. <laughs> I mean, uh, the students are essentially happy. They're like, we don't have to learn or, uh, you know, memorize this. And the parents table. are complaining that if they are, the school is teaching less, why are they charging still the same fee? All right, reduce that. Pankaj, uh, we better be off uh, yep. and uh, decide what's really happening uh, in the day today. Many thanks for all the viewers that have joined us in the comment section. I've been, I'm sorry, I apologize. I haven't been able to read every one of them, but I, I love the fact that you guys are also becoming a part of this with each passing day because that's the idea here. We live in uh, the day and age of social media and if times and technology is changing, so should we and journalism as well so that we can bring you better news that is for you and by you as well.